nighttime skies over Wrigley Field on the north side of Chicago. Tonight, the opener of a three-game series between the St. Louis Cardinals and the Chicago Cubs. Two great hitters lead their teams to battle next on MLB Network. John Lester will be on the mound for the series opener. Harold, any thoughts? Well, Matt, he's going to have his rough outings from time to time. ERA last year, just a little under four. But the thing about it is he's going to take the ball. Give me the ball. I'm going to take my knocks, but I'm going to keep you in the game. And that's what I'm looking for him to do in this ball game. Keep him in the game. Give him a chance to win. Stepping into the box, number 84. First Second shot for him here as he enters play, currently leading the senior circuit in batting. Into the windup and the pitch. Takes this the other way to right. Hayward is there, and it's a very quick inning as the side is retired. One, two, and three go the Cardinals. It's the Cardinals nothing. Cubs coming to bat. You're watching MLB Network. Anthony Rizzo stands in now. He was not much of a factor at the plate during yesterday's win as he took an 0 for 4 line. As anticipated, here's a ground ball now to the right side. Pro on to Carpenter gets him, and that ends the inning. Three up, three down for the Cubs. We are still scoreless. Ready for another chance. Now Number 84. Number 84. Over one for him here in this one. Come on, big guy. One time. Here you go. He's ready. Here's the first offering. A fastball right down the middle for a strike. Matt, here we are. Double play situation, and everybody knows he's got that sinker. Maybe get a ground ball and get two, right? But he comes with the fastball right there. Now nobody knows what to see. This is going to be an interesting at bat. Catch made here in medium deep right center, and the runner's breaking from third. And they'll extend their lead even further as the run from third is in. Riding in once again, number, number 84. 84. He hit a sack fly earlier. Into the windup and the pitch. Right over the middle, knee high. That's a big pitch right there. Now he's got him 0 and 1. And he still may not be comfortable. Even 0 and 1, he's still a pretty good hitter when he's down to count. This is a big pitch right here. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. He takes the turn and heads for second. And he'll pull into second with one away. Digging in once again, number 84. He doubled earlier in the game, one for two to this point. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Hit hard on the ground to second. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Down in order go the Cardinals, but they hold a four to nothing lead. Digging in to try it again. Didi Gregorius. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. Hey, let's go, big Looking to punch him out again. The pitch chopped weakly to the left. Oh, and it sailed right over his head at first. And they won't get him as he's able to advance from first to third on what would certainly be scored a throwing error. Cutting it close here, but... Well, just an excellent job right here, closing this one out. He just collected the first save of his career. Got to start somewhere. 4 nothing. the score tonight. Carlos Martinez earns the win his second. Tyler Lyons records four outs on his way to the save, his first of the year. So that'll put a wrap on things here this evening. For my partners Harold Reynolds and Dan Plezak, this is Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB Network. Good night, everybody.
from the windy city of Chicago, there's a beautiful look at fabled Wrigley Field. Today, it's the second of this three-game series between the St. Louis Cardinals and the Chicago Cubs. Stay tuned for Cubs baseball next. Jose Quintana gets the starting nod for the Cubs in this one. What do we need to know here, HR? Matt has lost two of the last three starts. A little bit of an inconsistent struggle, and hopefully this outing is a chance to turn it all around and start it in another direction. Standing in, number 84. And pitchers beware, because he's been off the charts hot to start the season. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Takes a look at one catching the outside corner. They charge the Cubs as they take the field here this afternoon. They come in not exactly setting the world on fire as they've dropped five of their last eight ball games. Well, we're looking at a ball club that really needs some leadership. They need one person to kind of step up, take his game to another level. They were shut out yesterday. They've been struggling lately. Just nothing flowing. Maybe a big hit, a big home run will ignite them and get things turned around. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. And that is down for extra bases as this will get one home and maybe two. The runner scores from second. In to score is the runner from first. It's a 2-0 ball game. And this is a... Digging in for his second at bat, number 84. One for one with two RBIs as he drove in a pair with a triple in his first trip. He's set and the pitch. Takes a fastball on the inside corner. I like that take right there. I know it's a strike, but man, they're making him work. He's been struggling early, and now they're making him work even more. You got to stay within your game plan and be patient, and I think this is a good plan right now. And that's through for a base hit, and they'll add another as this is now a 5 nothing game. Well, you just keep adding on. That's how you win games. Digging in to try it again. Number 84. Two for two with a triple on his batting line to this point. In there at the knees. Strike one. Great spot with that pitch down and away. He'll be fine coming out of the bullpen in this one if he can keep hitting that spot. Liner toward right center. And he'll lay out to make a spectacular catch. Wow. Absolutely jumped. Digging in now, number 84. Two for number three for him so far, including a triple. Come on now, big fella. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Takes a high fastball for a strike. That's a big pitch right there. It could change that bat. When you're facing a good hitter like this, that first pitch, strike one, is so important as to who's going to control this at bat. Right now, pitcher's got the advantage takes a knee-high fastball. He certainly hasn't been the aggressor in this at bat. Two straight takes, so now we'll see if he can change his approach and battle up. And that gets down and ought to be good for extra bases. Reyes rounds the corner and is headed home. And the run is in to score from second. It's a 7-2 ball game. Here's Leonis Martin. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Leonis Martin. Right, right oh, double play ball to second. Four, six, three, but it's not in time, and the inning will continue. Striding in once again, number 84, and he'll complete the cycle if he can blast one over the wall here. Here comes the first pitch. Hard hit ball to second. There's Baez. Throw on to first. Gets him, and the side is retired. One, two, three. Go the Cardinals. They hold a 7-4 to four lead. Ready once again. Didi Gregorius. 0 for 3 with a couple of strikeouts for him to this point in the ballgame. Come on now. One time. Here we go. Pitch on the way. Hit out towards second. Scooped up. Throw to first He's is out. in time for the first out. 
you can just see that the confidence is radiating off of them out there right now. That's six wins in a row, and this looks like a train that's not about to slow down anytime soon. 7-4 the final finish today. Alex Reyes notches his third win of the year. Jose Quintana struggled and gets the loss after giving up six earned. Trevor Rosenthal strikes out the side to record the save, his eighth of the season. So that'll just about do it. For Harold Reynolds, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. For more, don't forget to check out the shownation.com. Chicago there's a beautiful look at fabled Wrigley Field today the third and final game in this three game series between the St. Louis Cardinals and the Chicago Cubs these two should provide some big time fireworks first pitch is coming up Kyle Hendricks will do the pitching in game three of the series what do we need to know here HR. Well, Matt, he's been really good. He's got two wins in the last three starts. His teams have an opportunity to be in the game deep and late, and he's walked away, like I said, with two wins. So let's see if he's able to get three wins in four starts after this outing. Batting third. Second Standing baseman. in, number, number 84. 84. He was one of the stars from yesterday's game as he had three hits in the victory. Oh, and he shoots this back into center field for a base hit. That's what you call going to the play. Striding in once again, number 84, a number base 84. hit in his first trip. Drive it like you can. Let's go. From the stretch, here's the pitch. And a reach to his backhand side at second, but this finds a way by. And they're going to take a 1 0 lead as the run comes across to score. Well, no. Digging in and looking for more, number 84. Couple of singles to his credit thus far. And here's a fastball called for strike one. He's been doing a nice job out there on the mound, but the deeper you get into the game, the more the hitters have seen you. This is the part of the lineup that he has to be really careful with. And he lays out for it, but he can't pull it in out in deep center field. Around second, he's on his way to third. And he will make it all the way to third now as that mistake proves a costly. Digging in to try it again. Javier Baez. He's 0 for 1 thus far. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One -one. Hit on the ground out to short. Oh, and he has some trouble with it. But the recovery throw will be in time to first. A good job that time of not giving up on the play. And the inning is over. One left for the Cubs, and it remains a 3-1 ball game. Trying to pick things up where he left off. Number 84. He's looking to go four for four with a base hit right here. First pitch of the at-bat. Out into right center. Well hit. Legs churning. He's headed for second. And he's not stopping. He wants three. The relay throw. But he is in there with a triple. Wow, he's getting his daily conditioning. Wow, what a week for these guys. Talk about firing on all cylinders. Winners of an amazing seven games in a row. They say to never question the streak, and these guys aren't. They're just enjoying this ride. Four to two, the final score today. Michael Waka notches his third win of the year. Trevor Rosenthal closes the door for the save, his ninth of the year. So that'll just about do it for us this afternoon. Thanks to Harold Reynolds and Dan Plezak and the rest of our crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. To find out more, head on over to theshownation.com.